huh? Yeah. And then the kids get them first and then we get them afterwards. When I first uh, had my first day at the primary school, there were 50 kids. <laughs> Um, and there was only, I think, one ball and one teacher, um, and there was nothing that I expected. And in the UK, there's 15, 20 kids max, and it's, we've got so much equipment. So, and also the kids that I teach don't speak much English, especially the little ones. So it's been a real challenge, but I've enjoyed it a lot, and I'm getting through to them a bit more, and um, they're understanding. It well. I just I demonstrate what to do first because then they can they understand that and then trial and error. <laughs> well, what kind of things does she teach you? Lots of things. We practice all the time. But is she able to communicate with you guys? Yes. Yeah. Has she good ideas? Yes. <laughs> I wasn't really sure what to expect to be honest. Um, I didn't really think the kids would come from the sort of backgrounds that they do. We drove past their neighbourhood today. My kids actually don't come from Mitchell's Plain. They come from another area and it's all just slums and things like that. Um, so it's really, I think that's a good to see where they come from because you can a bit, you can relate to them a little bit more and understand their background. Um, yeah, as you can see, like the girls don't aren't playing with trucks, uh, proper kit. They've got <laughs> pumps and uh, eggs on and stuff like that. So it's been difficult to sort of facilitate the training, but you know we've got by and, and they're doing really well. I'm really proud of them today. You know, they don't come from the best background, so we've just got to accommodate as we can, really. We've just got them together just the last week, so just, I'm trying to pull a team together, see what positions they're suited to and things like that. Oh, where do you find them? How do you source the kids? Um, we just asked who's interested in playing, because that's the main thing, because we want you know, anyone who wants to play to get involved, and then take it from there. We had some trials and fitness sessions as well. Um, we've got very limited resources outside of the box. Uh, for example, goalposts, you know, don't think that you're going to get anything like that. You can use whatever you've got, maybe a chip packet, um, a brick or something like that. You've just got to um, use whatever you've got. It wasn't really nice because we lost. No, and why do you think that, that happened? Was it the team or do you think it was your playing? It was, it was a play. Not just it's a play. Both, both. Mm -hmm. So how are we going to win the next game then? Work harder. Yeah. Practice harder. Uh -huh. From the things that we now lost from, we're gonna, we're gonna learn, learn, learn from it. Very good, very good. I'm very proud of you, you did well. We'll win the tournament, yeah? High five.